You're just racking them up, deer crush. What was this, a, a pedestrian? <laughs> I'm headed to the warehouse, my brother's already up there. I was wondering where my keys went to my truck, but I remembered I gave Cole, my brother, the keys to the warehouse, so that's why I couldn't find them. Luckily, I have two sets. You always need two sets. I, have, I actually have like three or four. Holy crap. Whoa, 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 we got the copyright going on? The brother from the same mother award goes to Mr. Cole for cleaning out my my warehouse entry. Changing your oil? I think you crashed into Crush. I had to hit it, so I knew how close I was and I backed off. So. Jeez, dude, you freaking dented your car with it. Did you <laughs> notice that? That's oh, a I'm still, I'm still hitting it. Oh, That's know. a big dent. That's all right. It's Did you push this thing off the jack stands? <laughs> You hit my, you hit Crush, and <laughs> up your car. <laughs> oh my God, is that is that involved in the oil change? First, first shovel entry. Second, hit your brother's brand new machine, then change oil. <laughs> what are you gonna do next? Just spill everything everywhere? I can't believe you actually hit it. Well, I wanted to get in as far as I could because I gotta change my donut too. But I'll probably set the back in now. You brought donuts? No, my donut tire. I had a flat tire last night. I had to change it when I, before I left work. It sucked. I'm disappointed. I thought you had donuts. <laughs> Holy smokes, look at that thing. That thing is tiny. You got this car all screwed up. Did you hit crush a second time? Did you do the old double tap? No, that was uh, from a deer ahead. Oh, jeez. <laughs> You're just racking them up, deer crush. What was this, a, a pedestrian? <laughs> you still have the thing from the last oil change still under the hood there. No, I don't know. Oh, actually, yeah, it is. <laughs> I know it no, is. No, no, it's not from the last oil change, it's from uh, just when I had to put some in here. Because I got this, uh, this new fancy I can't. thing, which, you know, they advertise how <laughs> wonderful this pull tab is, and you pull and you get oil in your eye. <laughs> 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 it's like, oh. <laughs> Did it really? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. So be truthful with me. Did you hit this thing off the stands? No, I didn't hit it off the stands. Really? No, I just. I... How did that little piece of plastic Dude. dent up that piece of metal like that? Like, look at that dent. That That's is, a that freaking kind of dent. Well, no, it's metal. No, it's a piece of plastic. No, it's pretty hard plastic, though. Oh my goodness, you got that. You didn't break it because that was already broken. Oh, thank God. Well, yeah, I barely freaking tapped it too. I was going. <laughs> I was only going I 15 close. miles an hour. He parallel parks the same way. He he touches the front guy, touches the back guy, then gets right in the middle. Cole, you should really start teaching driver's ed. I think everybody would really appreciate you. Prime for a good time. Dirty machines taught me that. <laughs> Prime for a good time. That brings back the old good old days. Here, Cole, I'll fire this thing up for you. Or are you done? What else you gotta do? You, you, Take my filter and do my donut bang. Donuts? Oh, you're tired. Is the sidewall shot? It was flatter than the earth when I was at work. <laughs> so is there any leak? No, I don't know. Dude, it was freaking weird. All four of my tires, like, went, like once the, I started getting real cold out and everything, like all four of my tires, like, it would just be like one or two at a time would just go flat. Like every other day I have to freaking pump them up. Or sometimes it would last a week. And then I pretty much stopped and stopped doing it. And, um, for like two months straight, I have to f put any air in my day. Maybe there's somebody at work that doesn't like you. <laughs> <laughs> so Friday night I went live. I'm live right now and these guys are just throwing their comments in the comment section. If you want to be in the vlog, hurry up. Let's go, ladies and gentlemen. Holy smokes, you guys are going rapid speed. As you're aware, we're getting crushed ready to race. I'm going to take them around the country. We're going to hit uh, South Carolina, Ohio, New York multiple times, Indiana, and, and maybe a few others. First race ever is going to be April 21st. 
Society Hill, South Carolina. We'll have crush there. We'll probably bring some of the guys like Jake the Toilet Snake, Seth, my girlfriend, maybe my brother. We'll all be there. We'll, we'll be selling merch. We'll be racing. We'll be having a good time talking with you guys. Saying it, mark your calendars. No matter what age you are, whether you're five years old or 99 years old and on your deathbed and you need a wheelchair, come on out. I want to see you. I want to meet you. It'll be a very, very good time. If you get sick of me, there's going to be plenty of races throughout the day, throughout the weekend, so you won't be bored. Hello, Dave? Yes. Hey, this is Jake the Toilet Snake's buddy, Dalton. Yeah. Hey, I was wondering if you guys uh, rebuild shacks down there, or are you guys uh, send them out? No, I do them. Do you do them? I got four Fox shacks for my UTV. Okay. Would you be interested in doing them? Yeah, I can do them. Okay. These are the times and I'm glad I have a radio. So today my father and I went to a home show. I've only gone to one other home show in my life, but we went because he, he got paid to go because work, I don't know. But I ended up buying something. I bought some I bought some gel soles, these things. My dad's like, oh yeah, they're nice. So then the saleswoman started talking to me. She sold me. I guess they're supposed to massage your feet. It feels like you're walking on water. I guess it has benefits like machine merch. You know, you look good and it's comfortable. Well, these fine individuals are aware of those benefits, including Anthony Braff R. Yes, that's what his shipping label says. Derek O, Allison W, and Dylan W, Blake L, Adam L, Anthony H, Jamie D, Blake R, and Dylan H. But anyways, I also stopped by a stand and there was a guy selling cell phones. His name was Jason Voorhees. Yes, like the killer. And I think it's Crystal Lake or is it Spring Lake? I think it's Crystal Lake. He says, yeah, that was about 15 minutes up the road from him. He said it was waterproof, it was drop proof, all these, all these really cool things that I, you know, I drop. So I'm like, if I drop this thing and I break the screen, then you guys will, will replace it, right? And he's like, no, the insurance doesn't cover screen breaks, but it protects everything else. So I'm like, okay, if I drop this thing in a puddle, you guys will replace it. He's like, it's waterproof, but yes. So this next stand over had running water in this tub because it was some sort of plumbing pitch or something like that. So I'm like, okay, so you can take that phone and throw it in that bucket. He's like, yeah. I'm like, I'm like go ahead and do it and we'll, we'll start talking. Shacks are clean and ready to be rebuilt. 